Hey girls, welcome back to Heather Early Hearts. Let me get up a little bit. Okay, and happy fall. I have my fall decorations. I got my scarf on. I got my tunic and my leggings on and it's still 90 degrees. But it's officially fall, so we're gonna celebrate. I have something so exciting um, for you. I love dupe videos and dupes are taking a higher end or high end product and finding a much cheaper drugstore alternative that is the same, okay? And um, so I really enjoy these. And it's my first one. There's a lot of work that goes into them, so I just ventured into it. But what I'm going to be duping today are the highly sought after and highly expensive Urban Decay Revolution lipsticks. They look like this. They're $22, y'all. Okay? And, you know, we can splurge on one or two high-end lipsticks but in this day and age a lot of us just don't have the extra income and if you can find something that's just as good the same color and a lot of cases the same um consistency and the same formula for five dollars we should do it so i'm going to help you today in figuring out what the dupes are i'm going to start with my favorite at the moment um urban decay revolution lipstick and i bought this in full size before i found a dupe for it it's in the color shame I have it on my lips today. Um, here it is swatched. Okay. And on this side of my mouth, I have the color Shame by Urban Decay. And on this side, I have the dupe. Let me get in close. Now look, girls. I've been wearing this for a while, so it's outside the lines. But And excuse my crusty lips. <laughs> I've been putting a lip mask on and exfoliating. It's just not working. Okay. Anyway, um, the dupe for that is the Revlon Super Lustrous Lipsticks, the cream formula, and 477 Black Cherry. So that is what's on this side of my lips. And let me dupe them. And when I do dupes, especially lipsticks or anything really, I'm going to put them in one continuous line so you can actually see them side by side. So here it is. So this is the Urban Decay and this is the Black Cherry. So, that's pretty spot on. And you can see on the lips, it even looks more closer because of the pigmentation on your lips. So, that is the first dupe that I'm thrilled with. Um, the second one is my next favorite color. And again, did I just lose? I was like, where is that? Revolution lipstick is $22. Don't lose it. Okay. The next one is in the color Native. And I bought this in full size before I found a dupe for it. And it's a beautiful, beautiful nude pink color. Love this color. Love the way it looks on. Love the, of course, the formula is great, but really, really love that color. Love it. This is kind of my comfort zone color. It's the nudie pink, okay? So I had tons of these to try. I had them all up my arm trying to dupe it exactly. And this cover, let me tell y'all what it is before I start swatching. I'm getting ahead of myself. The CoverGirl Queen collection in the color Q440 Penelope Pink. Is an exact dupe and consistency wise it's just as good I'm um, just as creamy and there you go let me the lighting is not okay there that's better see it so this is the urban decay and this is the cover girl and you can see even the glistens the same it's a really good dupe really close okay the next one I have in a little bitty bullet I got it as a uh, I used a hundred point part a hundred points perk so I used a hundred points of my Sephora girl we're just gonna keep going it's a little size it's in the color cat fight it's a fuchsia color and I really had a hard time with this when I first saw it because I'm like you know I am not a fuchsia girl I don't have any fuchsias really maybe a couple and the ones I tried in my collection did not match and I'm like well I don't think I'm gonna be able to dupe this and then it hit me I have the Revlon Super Lustrous lipstick in the cream formula and 440 cherries in the snow and I always think of this as a red color but it's not it's a fuchsia and it is an exact dupe for catfight I mean these Revlon cream Super Lustrous they are a great Consist even a great consistency dupe for these formulas. So this is the Urban Decay and Cat Fight, and this is Cherries in the Snow. And look how close that is. Isn't that amazing? So I was happy about that. So I got the um, sample, and I don't have to go spend twenty dollars and get because I have something I actually like a little better, Cherries in the Snow. So and it's like seven dollars, six dollars, something like that. 
Okay, the next four Urban Decay Revolution lipsticks I have came in a set, and they're these little bitty bullet packs, so they're kind of hard to swatch, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get it, girl. I'm going to get it. Okay, this is in the color Naked. For all you people that aren't from the South, Naked means naked, or however y'all say that. It means no clothes, but I, when I say Naked, people are like, I don't know what she's talking about. It's Naked. Okay, so I'm going to swatch this. They're a little harder to swatch because I have to do it a couple times. Get my midget fingers in there. Okay. Okay. That's naked. And the exact dupe for that is the Rimmel lipstick in the 070 Airy Fairy. Same tone. Now these aren't as creamy as the but they're moisturizing, but they're just not as creamy as the Urban Decay, like the Super Lustrous Rub On ones. But look at that. There's the Urban Decay in Naked, and here's Airy Fairy. And look, no difference. Look at the sheen's the same. That's a good, that's a good dupe, girl. Okay. Look how red my hand is. It has product just stained from all the <laughs> swatching I've been doing. I'm sure my arm, my arm's even looking red now. Um, okay. The next one is in the color Obsessed, and I first saw this on somebody, Miss Lola Lynn, I think. She got this in Native, and I had to decide between the two, and I decided no Native. But this was a second choice that I wanted, like a close second. And I'm so glad I got this sample and duped it because I have it duped exactly. Color-wise, it's exact. The formula is a little different because what I'm going to show you is it's deep as a lip butter, so it's a little more sheer. But if you just swipe it two or three more times and build that intensity up, it's an exact color dude. It is in, let me tell you what it is. It is the Revlon Color Stay Lip Butter in the color 045 Cotton Candy. And this thing's seen some love, you can tell. And like I said, you the intensity is a little bit less, just as creamy though. So you're just going to have to build it up. Instead of doing one swipe, you might have to do three or four. You know what I mean? But look at that color. Look. That is the Revlon and that is Obsessed. That is the Urban Decay and that's Revlon. Let me put it back here. Focus. See that? Exact color dupe. So that's awesome. Okay, so I've done those two. Okay. The next one I is called F-Bomb. You know, Urban Decay likes to name their things scandalous things. But, oh, F-Bomb is just a pretty red. And I'm not a fuchsia girl, and I'm really not a red girl, so I had very limited to choose from. But, strangely enough, the first one I picked up, the first of my limited reds that I picked up was the dupe for this, which that never happens. I was so glad. It is the Jordana Twist and Shine Moisturizing Balm Stain in the color Rockin' Rouge. And like I said, again, this is a balm. This is a little more color than the Revlon balm. So you have to just build it up a little bit. But once you do, it's an exact color match. Okay? Just as moisturizing because it's a balm. But the color... And these colors aren't as sheer as some of the lip butters. But you do have to build it up just a tad. And look, there's the um, Urban Decay F Balm. And here's Rockin' Rouge. See that? Perfect color match. Isn't that exciting? And these things are like $3 as opposed to $22. You just saved yourself $19. After tax, it's $20. You can buy yourself a bottle of wine for that. You know I like that. Okay. The last color I'm going to show you was my hardest to match. And I got it really close. But this is probably the least precise dupe. But it's still a good dupe. Okay. It's in the color Anarchy. And it's a hot pink color fuchsia. Like I said, it's not... It's not really my cup of tea. Um, I like it, but I, and I'm trying to branch out and do more reds and, and fuchsias and stuff for fall, but, you know. Um, we all have things we gravitate towards, and fuchsia is just not one for me. Um, but I did finally find a dupe in the Milani Color Statements number 19 in Raspberry Flush. And looking at it, it has a duochrome and a, maybe a frost to it that even looks a little bluish. So I had picked, I had dupe. I had swatched all of my hot pinkish, and nothing was matching. I had a couple left to go, and I kept looking at this just in tube and thinking, no, that does not match. This has a blue frost to it. It's weird. And finally, I thought, I'm just going to swatch it, you know. And I did, and it actually is a dupe. Now, it's a little different in the fact that it's not as intense. Let me get close. So this is the Revlon, or I mean the Urban Decay 
and this is the Milani. See that? So it's a little, let me get out of the, that glare. It's getting on my nerves. Um, it's a little less intense in color. There, that's better. Just a little, though. You could build it up, and it looks just like it. Let me show you. See? So I think that's a good dupe, if you ask me. I mean, and this I got on sale for $248. Um, it was on clearance at Target, so I'm hoping it wasn't limited edition. If it, if it is, let me know, and I'll find you a, um, another dupe, because that would only be fair. I want to give y'all dupes that y'all can actually go to the store and find, or it's pointless to do these videos. Okay, so that is my first attempt at doing a dupe video. I will list all of the Urban Decay colors with their corresponding uh, drugstore dupes in the description bar for y'all, just so y'all don't have to, like, write them down or anything, so, um... But that's the dupes, and I think I have them all pretty much spot on. I'm very satisfied. And like I said, it took me a long time to do a dupe video because I wanted it to be well done. And not just like an almost color, a sort of color. Um, you know, I want it to be as spot on as I can get it. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope that you go out and find your own dupes and save yourself your, some money of, on your own, and that your day is filled with only the beautiful things. Thanks, girls. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. You subscribing to me just gives me feedback and lets me know you like what you're seeing and you would like to come back and see more. So that's like a, it's like a pat on the back, and so I really enjoy it. Okay, thank you, girls. Talk to you soon. Bye.